Paul Andrews, and I'm the president and CEO of the National Western Stock Show. Spellings. P A U L A N D R E W S. Okay, can you just tell me what's going on here? Yeah, today we're down here in the Wells Fargo uh, atrium having the annual lunch. It's a fundraiser for 4-H and uh, provided by Yazoo Barbecue. So tremendous uh, turnout here and uh, thanks to CSU, uh, one of the partners here, they're uh, sponsoring this event uh, along with Wells Fargo. So what does this event do? This event uh, raises money for 4-H. So people who are buying the $10 uh, barbecue here today, all that money goes to 4-H. And this is the, the traditional start of the stock show. I know that you guys had to cancel the, the parade. Um, can you talk about that, how rare that is? Yeah, so in the uh, 100 or so year history of the stock show, we've only canceled the parade twice, counting this year. And boy, walking 17th Street right now, I'm 100% sure we made the right decision. It would have been a very big disaster. So, uh, But this lunch uh, is a tradition here too, and uh, we wanted to keep going with that tradition. So this is the first day of the National Western Stock Show kickoff. So uh, can you talk about food? Food here is tremendous. It's a barbecue, barbecue pulled pork and uh, beans and coleslaw provided by Yazoo Barbecue. Very, very good. So for only $10, it's well worth it. Get entertainment as well. Get entertainment here. You've got the fiddlers playing in the background right now and uh, lots of speakers coming uh, today that are prominent Denver business leaders. So just a fun time for people to kick off Stock Show. So uh, what, do you think, uh, what do you think of the, the events planned for the Stock Show this year? Is there something new? This is going to be a huge year for the National Western, 111th year of the National Western Stock Show. we got a lot of mini animals this year. A lot of mini uh, bucking Bronx will open up stock show on the 7th this Saturday. We have some miniature donkeys in our National Western Nursery this year, which is going to be a hit for families and kids. So it's the year of the mini. we got a lot of mini new things. And we also have a brand new extreme dog show this year that I think people are really going to find enjoyable. In addition to our great rodeo, our great horse shows, acres of shopping experience. I mean, there's something for everyone. Yeah, it had nothing to do with the temperature. We could care less if it's minus 50. We'd have put the parade on. But minus 50 or zero degrees with a lot of snow, that's too risky to do. And any educated consumer will understand what I'm saying. So this is just traction, it's not, I mean, it's not show weather, it's supposed to be cold, right? Right, we love the cold, we love the cold, we love the snow for the National Western Stock Show, just not for the National Western Stock Show Parade. Yeah, the, 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 the economic impact of the National Western has been measured by a dozen firms, and it always comes out around $100 million for our 16 days in January. So many visitors here. We'll, we estimate between six and 700,000 will attend Stock Show again this year, and that's what's driving the economic impact.